Hello guys, how you doing? This is your friend Alex. Please watch this video from the beginning until the end so you don't miss any of the tips that I'm going to give you. Today I'm going to show you how to transfer two WhatsApps from the Android to the iPhone. In order to do this, you need to have an Android device with Android 5 or later, and you need to have iOS device with iOS 15.5 or later. I'm using a Moto E5 Play with Android version 8, and I'm using an iPhone 7 with iOS version 15.7.6. You know that Google Drive provides 15 gigabytes of free storage, and Apple iCloud provides only 5 gigs of storage. So if your WhatsApp is more than 5 gigs, you're going to need to buy extra storage on the iPhone. In this example, I have a few chats so it's not gonna be more than five gigs some Android devices allow you to install two WhatsApps I think you can clone the WhatsApp but in my case I'm gonna use WhatsApp business another thing guys once you start doing this transfer and fortunately you're gonna lose the catalogs and the collections on your WhatsApp business account so for educational purposes I'm gonna call my regular WhatsApp Shakira and my business WhatsApp is gonna be PK so let's open the regular WhatsApp and this is the number, 786-689-5529. This is the regular WhatsApp. I'm going to have one chat with a couple of texts, one image, and one video. That's what I'm going to have. On my business account, is going to be called PK Business. And this is the number, 954-715-1929. And on this business account, I'm going to have just one chat. That's going to be one picture and one video, okay? two separate numbers for two separate WhatsApp accounts. One is regular and one is business. So these are the steps. I'm going to copy these in the description so you can follow it. The first step is backing up both WhatsApp accounts on Google Drive. Let's start with the regular WhatsApp, Shakira. We're going to go to the three dots, settings. When it says chats, chat backup. All right, you're going to click here. You're going to select an account. You need to select a Google account. In this case, it's this account, okay? backup to Google Drive only when I tap backup and I'm going to include the video so total is going to be 4.2 megabytes okay and I'm going to do backup make sure you complete the backup guys make sure it's 100% all right so I just did my backup on the regular WhatsApp Shakir WhatsApp I'm going to close this and I'm going to open the business WhatsApp which is PK WhatsApp I'm going to click the three dots I'm going to go to settings chats and here I'm going to click chat backup I'm going to select a Google account. I'm going to include videos and I'm going to do the backup now. It's only 1.3 megabytes. Okay. Back it up. Okay. Something is happening because it says never. The reason it didn't work is because it was selected never. So you need to click only when I tap backup. Okay. Now I'm going to select my Gmail. And once I click backup, I'm going to do the backup on Google Drive. I'm doing the WhatsApp business backup on Google Drive. All right, so I finish it. We need to factory reset the iPhone because we're going to use an app called Move to iOS. And in order to use this app, we need to have the iPhone as factory reset. All right. So if you need to do a backup, do a backup. Once you finish doing the backup, you're going to go to settings, general. And you're going to click transfer or reset iPhone. Erase all contents and settings. Erase this iPhone. Continue. If you need to backup, let it finish. I don't have nothing to backup, so I'm just going to skip backup erase iPhone all right guys so this iPhone is gonna be factory reset and in the meantime I'm gonna go to the Play Store and I'm gonna download the application move to iOS install it open it Apple privacy policy agree so let's follow this click continue agree send up usage don't send location permission required you need to turn on location on your device and you're gonna click continue allow move to iOS to access this device location allow find your code Continue, and it says enter one-time code. This code is going to be here on the iPhone. Once it's factory reset, there's an option that is going to give you this code. So click English, United States, set up manually. Join the same Wi-Fi that you join on the Android. Data and privacy, continue. Touch ID later. Don't use. Passcode, don't use. Don't use. And this is the screen that we need. It's called Apps and Data. Here you can see an option calling Move Data from Android. So you're going to select that one. You're going to click Continue. And this is the code that you need to input here on the Android. 481987. Let's see if it works. So preparing. And it looks like it's working, all right? Here I just want to move WhatsApp. So I'm going to select WhatsApp. And here it is, Move Chats to iOS. I'm going to click Start. Almost done. 
continue now it's moving to iOS transfer complete it says so this is done I'm gonna click continue setup on iPhone I need to log into my Apple ID next and of course it's gonna ask me for a two-factor authentication that code is 76932 agree so I'm gonna click continue get started all right so I'm gonna go to the App Store and I'm gonna download the regular WhatsApp okay and this is downloading okay we open it agree and continue WhatsApp would like to send you notifications allowed what number are we gonna put here we're gonna put the Shakira number because that's the regular WhatsApp here 786-689-5524 that's the Shakira one okay number confirmation yes open WhatsApp on your order phone to get the six digit code enter it here 786-689-5524 okay yeah that's Shakira what's up okay so I don't know why it's doing this need help getting a code all right resend code enter this verification code on your new iPhone okay so it's gonna be five two three seven one seven and here it is guys move chats from Android so we're gonna click start start allow access to all photos now it's moving chats chat history move to iPhone next I'm gonna put uh, Shakira would you like to access your contacts okay and here we have the chats that we have before right it was one picture and one video right the video is working and the picture is working all right how can I get the name here you need to sign into your Gmail so go to Google continue and you're gonna sign in and that's how you get the contacts right we're gonna open again what's up and you see it changed to the name because it's now reading the contacts from Gmail all right guys so the first transfer works what we need to do here is we need to do an iCloud backup of this regular WhatsApp so we're gonna go to settings we're gonna go to chats and we're gonna do a chat backup you're gonna include videos and you're gonna click backup now by doing so we are doing a backup on iCloud and now we're finished now we have a backup of the regular WhatsApp so we're good what's next now it says delete both WhatsApp's accounts on Android we're gonna delete both so we're gonna click app info and you're gonna uninstall do you want to uninstall this app okay uninstalling WhatsApp okay so that WhatsApp is gone now delete this one click and hold and you're gonna click this and you're gonna uninstall WhatsApp business do you want to uninstall this app okay now this is the trick we're gonna go to the Play Store and we're gonna download the regular WhatsApp. But this time, instead of using Shakira's number, we're gonna use Piquet's business number, right? Open English, agree and continue. And this is important. What number are we gonna use? We're gonna use the number from Piquet's. Remember, Piquet's business WhatsApp account, which was 954 715 19 29. This is important. WhatsApp Messenger recognized that this was a uh, business information. Switching to WhatsApp Messenger will delete all of your business information. Only your messages and media will move. You will permanently lose your catalogs and items. By switching, you confirm you approve deletion of your information. And we're gonna click switch. They're gonna send a code. And this is the code. I'm using a Google number for this WhatsApp account. And this is the code, 183899, 183899 contacts and media continue allow whatsapp to access contacts allowed access photos media allowed and this is the beautiful thing guys it's going to restore this account from the business backup that i did on google drive it's a beautiful thing i'm going to click restore okay and click next i'm going to put pick a business right and this is the chat that i used to have remember one picture one video okay <laughs> all right uh i love that actor by the way all right so once i have it here i only have one whatsapp account and this is the pk account right the 954 what we're going to do here is we're going to have to factory reset the iphone again so we can use the move to ios again so we're going to go to settings general and here transfer or reset iphone erase all contents and settings continue it says uploading data to iCloud you know it's taking longer so I'm just gonna keep I'm just gonna skip it all right it's asking me for my password erase iPhone erase iPhone 
Okay, so the iPhone is going to be erased. What I'm going to do just in case, guys, you know, I'm going to go to chats and I'm going to chat back up and I'm going to make sure that I'm using a Google account that I include in the videos and back up to Google Drive only when I tap back up. So I'm going to back it up, guys. Back it up, back it up. And it's only 1.6 megabytes. Now I have a fresh backup of WhatsApp. We're waiting for the iPhone to reset. In the meantime, we're going to use move to iOS again. Apple privacy policy, agree. Move to iOS, continue. Agree. Send app usage, don't send. Find your code, continue. And this is the code that I'm going to find on the iPhone, which is ready. Look, English, United States, set up manually. Join the same network as this one. Data and privacy, continue. Touch ID later, don't use. Passcode, don't use, don't use. Apps and data, this is the screen we need. Move data from Android. Move from Android, continue. It's gonna give us a code. We're gonna put the code here. And we're gonna be ready to move. It finally worked, I don't know how, but it worked, guys. So we're gonna select here, what's up? Move chats to iOS, start. Almost done. Next. Continue. Transferring from Moto E5 Play. Transfer complete. Done. And I'm going to click continue setting up iPhone. I'm going to log in with my Apple ID. Finally got the two-factor authentication that is here. And the code is 789958. Terms and conditions. So I'm going to click continue. Set up later, get started. So let's open the app store and we're gonna look for WhatsApp. WhatsApp Messenger. Almost done, guys, almost done. Open, agree and continue. Now I'm gonna click allow. And now what number are we gonna put? We're gonna put the PK number, right? Which is 954, 715, and 1929. This is the number we use for the business WhatsApp on the Android. Number confirmation, double check. Oh, they said we couldn't send an SMS to your number. Please check your number and try again in one hour. Yeah, this is the problem with you verify the account twice during the day, you know? We can maybe request a phone call. Okay, so I'm gonna request a phone call now. Hold on, and call me. And that's the call, guys. I'm gonna answer it. And that's it the verification go and look at this move chat from android start start allow access to all photos next and i'm gonna put here pk business and hopefully we're gonna get a backup here hold on access to contacts okay so we're gonna do the same thing we're gonna use google to access our contacts I'm gonna save it and use this is gonna turn into a contact yeah you see it turns into a contact and let's click this and you can see that we have the picture and the video okay so we're good on that one now we need to back up this on iCloud click on settings chats chat backup you're gonna include videos and you're gonna back it up now we are successful with the backup what the video says is that we need to delete WhatsApp. I already did the backup on iCloud. Now I'm gonna have to delete this one. Delete app, delete. And it says I have to install WhatsApp again. I'm gonna start it with WhatsApp regular, the Shakira one, WhatsApp Messenger. I'm gonna download it and I'm gonna use the Shakira phone number, the main account number. I'm gonna open WhatsApp. Agree and continue. And here, guys, we're going to use the first number, the main account number, which is 786-689-5524. So hopefully we're going to be able to restore our cup that we did before on iCloud. I hope, guys. I hope. And I got the code right here. It's 397293. And this is the beautiful thing, guys. We found the backup we did on iCloud. We found it. So we're gonna restore chat history. Next, this is gonna be Shakira. So even the picture is there. And this is our message, guys, with the picture and the video, okay? The picture and the video. 
that's the video so this was successful all right now now let's install whatsapp business we're gonna get whatsapp business so we're gonna install whatsapp business agree and continue and i will say allow and it says use 786 i don't want to use 786 because this is shakira's main number i want to use the 954 number so i'm going to click use a different number and this number is 954 715 1929 okay this is the business account that we used to have on android make sure that is the number click done and look at this this is a beautiful thing this is the backup that we did on icloud this icloud backup is found based on the phone number that we did the backup with all right this is very important restore chat history and again this is going to be just one picture one video six messages restore it and this is going to be pk that's pk look business name pk business done we're going to put order business next allow what's a business to access your contacts okay then we go to chats and we have the picture and we have the video all right so amazing guys so now guys we have regular whatsapp which is shakira with the 786 number and we also have the business whatsapp which is pk with the 954 number and we were able to transfer all the chats that's that one and this is this one look right there guys successful we have two whatsapps and we transport it we move it from the android this is a beautiful tutorial guys i didn't know it was going to work but it works i want to say thank you to this guy this guy is the new tech world i want you to subscribe to his channel he's great he did all of this in hindu and i'm doing it in english but i want to say thank you to him because i follow his tutorials and i was able to do it successfully so please subscribe to his channel say thank you to him because without him i wouldn't be able to do this tutorial for you guys just to summarize i was able to transfer two whatsapps accounts from the android to the iphone using move to ios i did it twice because you cannot natively transfer whatsapp business from android to iphone i needed to convert my whatsapp business to regular whatsapp and i was able to transfer i'm going to put all the steps in the description so you can follow it let me know in the comments if you have any questions guys i want you to thank you for watching this video i want to also let you know that it takes a lot of resources and effort to do these videos the best way you can support my channel if is you subscribe so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and that's it guys thank you so much i'll see you on my next video bye thank you to that guy all right don't forget new tech world i want to take the opportunity to say hi to all my friends from india i have a lot of subscribers and followers from india i hope i can visit india soon thank you